Hi everyone, welcome to my channel, Wonderfully Made. Thank you so much for stopping by my channel. I really appreciate it. Listen, because of the fact that I have very little time to film videos, I decided to just pull out my cell phone. I have this little tripod that comes with like a little bitty uh, ring light attached to it and got my phone attached to that. And so I'm in my office. I'm I like, do apologize for not filming v videos and for not being consistent because you guys have been so supportive uh, to my channel and I really appreciate it. But I'm hoping this is a solution. If I bring my camera and bring the things to my office, maybe I can fit a quick video in my day while I'm here at the office because once I get home, it's a wrap. I just can't. But yeah, I do have a quick little unboxing or little mini luxury haul um and i'm just gonna get straight to it but first guys please hit that subscribe button if you're not subscribed and please hit the notification bell because you never know when your girl is gonna post a video the first thing i'm gonna show you guys is um i jumped on the bandwagon okay and it is something from coach it is the infamous the 2021 spring bag of the year <laughs> is the coach pillow leather tabby bag y'all I, I jumped on the bandwagon this handbag is so pretty oh my goodness it's so pretty the videos and the camera just do not do this bag justice yes i jumped on the bandwagon and bought this handbag even though i said i was not gonna do it i'm like i'm not buying that but i went to dillard's and i passed by this bag and i literally had to back up <laughs> This handbag is so pretty. Oh my goodness. It's so, the leather is just so soft and plush. And oh, I love it. But this is the pillow leather tabby in the size 26. They do have the mini bags as well, but the mini bags were just way too small for me. This and that's the ivory. It does come in, I think, a pink and a, uh, I think it comes in black. And there's another color I can't remember but it comes in several colors I purchased mine from Dillard's um, and yes it is beautiful it has like the brass gold hardware it comes with the little shoulder strap it actually matches what I have on today my suit that I have on today for work um, but I love it and this is what it looks on the inside this it comes with a nice thick a really nice thick leather crossbody strap so i love that about it and it has this uh it basically has two compartments you have a little zip uh pouch in the center here and then you have two slots here one on each side of the little center zippered pouch and that's pretty much it. I would take this bag somewhere where I didn't need to have a whole lot in it, okay? Basically, you're gonna fit your essentials in here. Um, it does fit my phone and I have the um, iPhone 12 Pro Max. So I have the largest iPhone and it fits in here just fine. Um, that's always a major test for me. And I did not own any handbags in this color. And I did want this color. I prefer to go with something more affordable for like, you know, an ivory color or a colorful bag. So this for me was a great buy because it's on the more affordable end. And I know that it's something that I'm not gonna use extremely often, but I absolutely love it. It's worth the hype. <laughs> now, how long the hype is going to last, I don't know, but I love, I love, love this bag. I'm going to show you my um, pre-loved purchase. I did get it from Fashion File. 
Um, it claims that it is brand new and it does look new. Um, and this is a Louis Vuitton purchase. Now, I just said that when I'm purchasing a colorful bag, I like to go with something more affordable. And that's why I chose this bag on the pre-loved market. Because so this is the Louis Vuitton Pont Mini Pont Neuf bag. Pont Neuf Neuf Pont P-O-N-T. N E U F. <laughs> I know I'm probably butchering the pronunciation, but this is the bag and it's in the color Poppy. Um, now, I'm not going to lie when I ordered this bag. I thought it was going to have more of an orange in it, but it's almost like a pinky red. Um, but I still love it. Love it, love it, love it. It's going to be great for a pop of color. It does fit my phone and it has. Louis Vuitton here. Oh my goodness, it's so pretty. The hardware is silver. And when I told you this bag is definitely brand new. Now this is from 2016, so it does have very minimal wear from storage but you can tell it's never been used. Um, it does have a little zipper, uh, zippered slot here. Okay, there we go, I unzipped it. So you can definitely fit like some cards and here's some cash um, if you want to. In the inside, it has the little dust bag and it does come with the cross body strap again it has the silver hardware it does have a little slip pocket here and it did come with the uh the little tag here with the uh product code on it and i absolutely love this bag I love it, guys. It is so pretty. Love the on-print leather. Oh my goodness. Beautiful bag. It does have the feet at the bottom. So can't wait to put this to use. Next, I'm going to show you an item that I ordered that has been on my wish list for a minute. Um, it's a small little item, as you can tell. And so let me go ahead and share that with you guys. Here. Can you guess what it is? It is the Louis Vuitton Victorine wallet. I needed a small wallet. I love my Gucci wallet, but it is a full size wallet. I do have a full sized uh Louis Vuitton wallet that one of my good friends gave to me a while back, um, but it it has seen better days. But I needed a small wallet that can fit in just about any handbag that I use. And as you can tell, it fit in here with no problems. And so, yes, this is the Victorine wallet in the monogram print with the fuchsia accents color and there it is when you open it up it has a little coin pouch built into it now it's kind of tight in my opinion you're not going to be able to fit a whole lot of coins in there but you can fit a few coins in here um, you could probably fit a card or two in there um, but this would be all I needed especially if I'm you know, going shopping or going on a trip and I just wanna take the bare minimum, you can put cash here. It has uh, three, one, two, three, yes, three card slots. Plus you can you know, probably slip your ID up in that little slot here. There's space to put a card underneath here too. And I'm saying three card slots, but it's actually six, three on each side. <laughs> Let me clarify that. It has been on my wish list for a long time. And I went ahead and purchased it because I know Louis Vuitton is constantly having price increases. 
and before things just get completely out of hand especially with the small leather goods because at a certain point it's just not going to be worth it to me um, to purchase small leather goods when the prices become ridiculous I, I just won't do it so my goal is to go ahead and get all of the small leather goods that um, that's been on my wish list hopefully before the next price increase and then finally my final purchase is from Prada this is yeah, this is actually my very first Prada purchase, and I did get it from the Prada website. As you all know, I love luxury products, but I tend to purchase, uh, you know, the more affordable pieces. <laughs> I tend to get those pieces that will give me the most value for my money and this is something that i've seen so many videos on um, it was sold out for a long time but they come in and out of stock and i happened to catch it in stock and i picked it up tell me can you guess what it is <laughs> but this is the dust bag it came in and here it is this is the Prada nylon pouch. And guys, this thing is spacious, okay? It is completely stuffed right now with, you know, paper and all of that. But you can fit so much into this bag, okay? Look at that. I mean, it is so spacious way more spacious than i thought it would be i'm definitely going to be purchasing um a leather strap and maybe some different um accessories to kind of you know spruce it up a little bit and i'm going to try to link some of the channels of the youtubers that i've seen review and style this uh bag because once you add a um strap to it or crossbody strap you can wear this bag crossbody you can wear it as a shoulder bag i mean it really turns into a beautiful bucket bag <laughs> with ease with you know nice leather straps from amazon or anywhere really um or if you already have some leather straps in your collection you can just you know put them on this bag and you have a beautiful prada bucket bag I think the Prada bucket bags are going for around $1,200, if I'm not mistaken. Um, and I'm not sure if they're nylon or leather. I think they're nylon. Um, so Prada is known for their nylon bags. Um, technically, this is a cosmetic bag, but I love the fact that it's a carefree bag. You don't have to worry about damaging it, dirty, getting it dirty. You know, you could just wipe it off. Um, and so, yes, I have not used this, but this is definitely coming with me on vacation as well because, number one, I can just basically fold it really easily once I take the paper out and stuff it in a, a suitcase and not worry about it, you know? So, love, love, love this purchase. I actually want it in another color. This is $495. I mean, so you can have a beautiful Prada bucket bag for 500 bucks, okay? Um, as opposed to paying the $1,200 for a bucket bag. So wanted a bucket bag in my collection anyway. I do have the Louis Vuitton Neo Noe, I think is how you pronounce it, on my wish list. So I do want that bag, but for now, this will serve the purpose that I need it for. So guys, that is it for my little luxury haul. And I'm calling it a luxury haul. It's Coach Luxury. I always question whether or not Coach and uh, Michael Kors and those types of brands are considered luxury brands. They are in my opinion because they're still not, you know, it's not a $20 bag. And just so you know, for informational purposes i believe that this bag is 495 dollars um the wallet is 570 dollars and like i said the prada bag is um 495 dollars and then you can still find this um louis vuitton pont neuf 
Mini, I think is how you pronounce it. You can still find this on the pre-loved market. I did see that there was, um, that this bag was available on the Real Real, Trade C, um, and a couple of other sites. Um, so I've seen it in this color poppy. I think I saw it in black and blue. So it did come in several colors back in 2016. Um, and so you still can find these on the pre-loved market. I love a structured handbag. So this just gives me all of the feels. You know, something that I could just throw around and put it down and not be, uh, you know, too worried about uh, it being damaged and the emprunt leather is definitely a carefree type of material um so i love the emprunt leather this bag because of the color i'm definitely probably going to have to you know handle it with a bit more care and also the leather is so plush and puffy um, I am concerned that there may be some denting um, in this bag, so I am going to keep it stuffed um, and make sure I, you know, I'm not going to baby it. I don't like to baby any of my items, period. I do not like to baby my stuff. I like to use it, and I like for it to look worn at some point, <laughs> but I do try to take care of it. So anyway, guys, thank you so much for stopping by my channel. I so appreciate you taking a few minutes of your day to spend it with me. Um, I hope this video was helpful. I hope it was, you know, a little bit entertaining. I hope it gave you a minute to just breathe and smile and think about the things that you like and make you happy because <laughs> these things bring a smile to my face and make me happy and it allows me a little bit of an escape from the busyness of everyday life <laughs> so anyway guys thanks again i so appreciate it please again subscribe give me a thumbs up um that way i will kind of stay in the loop a little bit <laughs> um, when it comes to the youtube algorithm um, and yeah, thanks guys. As always, remember that you are fearfully and wonderfully made by God and he loves you and I'll see you in the next video.